Hello YouTube, Caitlin here, and is there any time of year that you absolutely hate? Maybe it's Christmas because you're a Scrooge, or New Year's because you just hate how people make New Year's resolutions and then don't do anything about them for like the rest of the year. Or it could be the summer because you hate hot weather or just any number of things for why you hate a particular time of year. But I bet, I bet there is something that you hate. Tax time, definitely tax time. The time of year that I hate the most though is something that you'll find rather interesting. You see, I hate the month of April. Now you say to me, April? What's wrong with April? I mean, what do you have against spring? Well, it's a lot of things. Let me list for you some things that go on in April. Springtime, which equals evil allergies, ridiculous weather, which involves a lot of rain, and ruining of my hair. Easter falls a lot in April. It didn't happen this year, but it was very, very close. I have been a student for the last umpteenth million years, and April is the worst time for students because it's either SOLs if you're in high school or it's crazy end of the semester exams if you're in college or grad school. All the spring sports are in the middle of their seasons in April. And my birthday is April 16th. It's right in the very center of April. As a side note, April 16th is also when the Virginia Tech massacre was. That's on my birthday when I was turning 17. Not exactly something that you feel very celebratory about. My problem is that I want April to be my favorite month so bad because it's my birthday and it's spring and it's gonna be summer soon and it's just the end, almost the end of the semester and so it's like, yes! But all of your environment is like, no! <laughs> People are also doing beta vlog every day in April or beta blog every day in April, which I've always wanted to do but I just can't. It would just be awful. <laughs> like how neat would it be? Like how neat would it be to be able to vlog on your birthday and be like, hey, this is you know, this is what I'm doing with my friends, yeah. Except I don't really get to celebrate my birthday all that well most of the time because it's so hard to get people together in April because everybody's dealing with the same thing. <sighs> Every year I go into April thinking, I'm going to make this April better. I'm going to have a positive attitude. I am going to be excited. I'm going to celebrate my birthday. I'm going to do all of the fun things that I want to do. And the next thing I know, it's, it's May. And I am like, thank goodness I'm out of April. I don't know about you, but I think that a lot of times when we hate a certain time of year, it's because we can't really experience it the way that we'd like to experience it. Like my father really loves the summer because he loves warm weather, but he builds pools and so that's his busiest season. And so it's just absolute stress and craziness and exhaustion all the time. Maybe you really don't like Christmas because you're having to work during Christmas and so you're not having the time to go get all the presents or spend enough time with your family, all the things that you feel like you're supposed to do because it's Christmas time. So that's what tends to go on with me. I wanna enjoy April so badly that I don't enjoy it because I have such high expectations for it. Caitlin, you just need to slow down and smell the roses. Really? That's your answer to this problem? Ooh, bird. So what do you think? Is there a time of year or month or season or something involving time that you just, uh, it just drives you up a wall because maybe you can't enjoy it like me or maybe there's some other reason. Tell me in the comments because I want to know and we can discuss and have fun and be friends. And remember to like, favorite, share, and subscribe if this video made you smile. Oh, you keep stealing my line! <laughs> See you guys next Thursday. Peace!